Good morning. Welcome to the Nifty Prediction. My name is Narendran. To join my WhatsApp group, I am charging 500 rupees per month. You will get live calls in the group as well as advanced predictions uh, in the group. Uh, let's go to the uh, review for uh, Friday market and then we will go for the prediction for Monday. Uh, Nifty ended up in the flat positive on Friday 11,930.35. 33.90 points in the positive, 0.28 percent in the positive. Opened around 11,957.90, high went around 11,974.55, low went around around 11,908.75. Let's go to my prediction in the group calls. In the morning around 9:10 after the pre-market open, I have given the range because the market we know that already if you saw my yesterday video about the prediction for friday i have given that the market is showing bullish kind of thing but still the pre-market open after the pre-market open it is opened in the volatile range i will show you in the excel chart how it is shown so that is the indication as per the pre-opening uh, nifty in the volatile zone uh, even though it is showing bullish uh, in our data but still some hints are there it might give up its positive and go towards to the negative side as well so safe traders stay away from the market at 910 itself asked my clients to stay away from the market because of uh, risk status may may make money but stay uh, small traders must have to stay away from this market it won't move that much because positive target is having around uh, uh, 179 points and negative side having around 122 points so we need to keep both side positions but still it is not going to be that much easy that is the reason i have uh, given uh, safety traders must, must have to uh, stay away from the market this is the one week call we used to normally buy which is uh, buying and holding for a one week time uh, 12200 call option for 23.25 uh, before uh, and uh, 11700 for 33 which even all put together it, it will cost you 57 or roughly if you take at 60 so maximum your risk will be 4500 is the maximum risk for a week so anything goes in a week time if market goes around 500 points up or 500 points down one particular uh, call or put option will go somewhere around 200 to 250 or 300 something like that so that is the idea to behind the maximum risk of uh, 4500 we need to take and hold for a week tenure in between if we have any kind of uh, means i will update uh, that is the end and after that i didn't give a call because i i know that it is not going to be a a bullish or bearish market is going to be a range bound market so i i didn't given any call after that at 1 38 pm i given the range how it is going to close it, it is going to close in between these two ranges uh given and um, the power value is the more suitable to close today around 11930 exactly that is where it has closed uh, 0.35 is the difference if you know uh from uh, around 138 i have given the exact number and the market has closed almost exactly the same 11930 0.35 0.35 is the difference so this is the reason because uh, our data is unique and it gives you a clear hint where it is going to align and where it is going to go so uh, that is the reason i i didn't given uh, and uh, in my uh, facebook uh, I, uh, around monday market uh, uh, I mean uh, that is not this Monday market past uh, record which shown in the flattish kind of uh, range five years back uh, 20, uh, 26th October 2015 but it will change because over the five years period so many data and so many moments will be there so uh, as per five years back it is shown in the flat kind of thing but uh, uh, after I took the data it is shown uh, some kind of a uh, big bearish or bullish also possible because uh, uh, the data is showing uh, like uh, um, evenly poised I'll tell you explain you later and uh, in that data itself I have around 12 o'clock itself I have uh, sent uh, with the possibility of closing around 11,930 because that is what uh, we know uh, it is going to close in that kind of a range and uh, this is the this is the uh, uh, weightage which shows for Monday the evenly poise in the uh, absolute frequency which means evenly poise comes means it will be like uh, all three results or all three results are possible but uh, the data weightage is having huge four percent on the positive and four percent on the negative which means if it is breaking it might go uh, heavy on the downside as well as upside but uh, uh, as per the closing 
and uh, i asked one more buying call uh, for 11900 pe because we bought it somewhere around uh, 150 to 155 and uh, i asked to uh, watch out but i didn't give an exit call but somebody because at that time it was around 4000 profit so i i asked for a watch out call watch out means sometimes some people might have exited uh, with a profit of 4000 so if anyone would have exited means they would have uh, once again bought uh, uh, this particular 11900 put option for 80 to 85 because this is the call which i given uh, uh, 150 to 155 to bought it was at 206 which means 4000 profit which is a good money so that is the reason uh, watch out means some people would have exit that call on that particular day and i didn't give an exit call uh, by the way and uh, but insurance i have asked to buy 12200 call option for 21 to 22 and uh, yeah, this particular level is the key if anything close below that level market will be a bearish for monday so it is closed below that level so we are expecting a bearish but still all three results are possible because of this absolute frequency evenly poised uh, so let's go to the excel chart for uh, friday how it is closed uh, as per the data it is bullish okay but as per the data it is bullish all indications have shown bullish and market is also open in the bullish but what uh, what and how it is indicating volatility and why it is not moved that much because uh, in the market in in my data the formula which is if the pre market opens in between those volatile levels in between if you check out uh, 11972.59 below only the market has opened pre market opened below that level 11005 uh, less or 11957.90 which is below that 972 so that is the indication so which it is opened below that level anything market opens in between that level means it is indicating volatile level so Uh, in the volatile zone if it is opens means it need to break uh, that particular stop loss level which is 11982.59 this is the stop loss level so if it is breaking then only it is activating the bullish trend um, this particular uh, normally we used to keep 10 point stop loss so 11982.59 is also not broken on the high you can check this 11974 it is not broken that stop loss level so it is not uh, going to move on the positive direction so that is the hint and then on the downside it is came down uh, and it 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 has kept the r1 as a support level 11907 exactly that is where 11907 uh, it has kept the low 11908 so normally we have the calculation for stop loss 10 points and 3 points is the matching point so it is perfectly matched and it has closed in the par value because the par value is exactly in the range of 11930.90 the market has closed 11930.35 almost in the par value range uh, let's go to the prediction for monday so monday uh, the data is showing that uh, ratio is on the positive side but the front of one point so after a pause it might fall down and average is indicating negative it is indicating negative absolute frequency evenly poised so which means it is kind of a uh, market which having a negative impact uh, with a, a result of all three results possible because evenly poised means it might go positive as well so it might open in the positive uh, then fall down towards to negative that is also uh, having chances to happen so we need to play much more cautiously we must have to keep uh, two uh, lots i mean two options in the uh, uh, hand uh, positive i mean uh, call option as well as put option you need to have uh, the levels which we can expect the because the trend is in the negative side because the market is closed on that particular key level which i highlighted in the Mm, in the group call in this particular level the market has closed below that level which indicated the bearish so it is indicating bearish but still why we need to keep both side because this absolute frequency indicating evenly for so for the safety purpose we need to keep both side lots on the other hand if the market is uh, opens above 
volatile level anything more than 31 points above indicating bullish with the stop loss of overall leverage which is 11,909.60 is the stop loss for the bullish market but it has to open above that particular 31.02 31.05 like that above it has to open and this particular stop loss is not breaking the bullish is intact on the other end for the bearish market the volatile level which is 30 almost 37 points anything opens below that level indicating the bearish market with a stop loss of overall average which is 11,929 we need to add uh, 10 points from this 65 so 11,929.65 is the stop loss for the bearish market but if the market is opens in between the volatile range which is indicating a volatile zone uh, it might go uh, flat kind of thing but what happens is if anything breaks the level which side it is break the level first according to that it will uh, become bearish with the stop loss range we need to keep resistant level 1 as a stop loss so 11,000 946.35 is the stop loss for the bearish market after it is breaking likewise the same if it is breaking uh, market may open in the level but after it is breaking this positive level means we need to keep this support level as a stop loss 11903.19 is the stop loss so these are all the method which we can um, keep and uh, what what will happen is it might break the bullish open target level and go towards to any extent if it is not breaking once again it will fall down uh, if the bullish open target level or the positive average likewise the same if it is not breaking the bearish open target level then it might recover from the low around 122 if it is breaking it will go to any extent so all the results are possible on this specific day but as per the data <clears throat> the power value is showing 11906 so as per the pre-open if anything opens 23.94 above so which means even negative if it is opens uh, even 22 points ne negative if it is open still the positive target one and positive to target two will be activated so which means it might go bullish so we need to play much more cautiously that is what it is indicating uh, if anything opens more than 24 points on the negative side it is activating a negative target one and negative target two so both sides we are having huge points 237 and 278 so that is the reason we need to keep both option in hand for, on the safety purpose otherwise if you holding single uh, side uh, it will be like uh, uh, luck need to favor and you need to be on the right track uh, so if then only you can able to make money let's see how the market is going to give us on monday thank you